In this video on C Sharp Basics, we'll be discussing some important topics regarding using strings. First, let's discuss concatenation. Concatenation is where you combine two strings together with the concatenation symbol. So for example, here we have the variable called greeting and we're assigning its initial value to hello, my name is, and then we're concatenating the name John. Sometimes you'll have a numeric variable that you need to include as part of a string. To do that, you can simply use the toString extension method and that will convert a numeric variable to a string. So for example, if we have the variable called pi and we have its initial value set to the value of pi, then we want to include that as part of a string. You can see here that we're using the toString extension method to convert that variable of pi to a string. Then we're concatenating it to the statement Tom says the value of pi is. Finally, let's talk about escape sequences. Now escape sequences use the backslash character to indicate a special Unicode escape sequence. So for example, the backslash r is a carriage return. The backslash n is a new line. And when you use backslash r backslash n together, that actually creates a new line within a string, similar to if you hit the enter key on your keyboard. Then there's the backslash t, which indicates that there should be a tab inside your string. Sometimes you'll need to declare the literal use of an apostrophe, or otherwise known as a single quote. You do that by using the backslash apostrophe. Similarly, we have the backslash quotation mark, and you need to use this whenever you want to indicate quotation marks are included inside the string. And finally, if you need to include a backslash as part of the string, you can simply use the double backslash and that will place a backslash character inside of the string. So here's an example of where we're using escape sequences to make the string work how we want it to. We can see we have quotation, backslash quotation, I saw a man, backslash quotation, Charlie said, comma, backslash r, backslash n, backslash quotation mark, he was running east on Main Street, dot, backslash, quotation mark, quotation mark. And that will result in, I saw a man in quotation marks, Charlie said, comma, and then we have a new line where it says, in quotes, he was running east on Main Street. In the next video, we'll demonstrate some of these different issues that you'll encounter while you're using strings.